Good morning, my lovelies, and welcome to a very wet Friday morning. Very bedraggled Miss Lou as well. I hope you're all very well, lovelies. Uh, so this morning, um, when I got up, it was raining. Well, it wasn't raining, it was spitting. And I ummed and aahed and ummed and aahed about whether or not we should go out. And then I thought, oh, do you know what? Stuff it. Let's go out. Um, it's not bad, it's only drizzle. We'll pop out. Miss Lou's all very excited here, so I'm going, well, you pick where do you want to go. And she's decided we're coming here today, this morning, her favourite place in the woods. So, yes, even though it's raining and poor Miss Lou is soaked, and I'm a little damp, shall we say, um, it's been quite a nice walk in the woods this morning. Um, the rain's not so bad and if you're sort of in the woods here it's quite nice because you can hear it falling through the canopies and it's such a soothing sound you know it's such a a calming and soothing sound. It's a squirrel, baby. And I find rain, no matter what kind, whether it's a drizzle like this or a torrential downpour, I do find it very, very soothing. Rain is, is my daughter's favourite thing. She loves a good rainy day. If we get a stormy day, it's even better. But yeah, uh, rain, water in general is the life giver of everything. You know, we get a good a good downpour, and everybody says, "Oh, the garden needed it," but it does because rain, you know, makes sure that the fauna and flora of our planet is watered, and it doesn't die off. It gives our animals listen to that it gives our animals a drink so they're not dying of thirst it waters our crops it makes sure that we have a drink you know that we've got plenty of water to survive and without it we're buggered really aren't we So for all of you who think, oh God, it's raining, I don't like it, I'm going to get wet. Yes, you're going to get wet, so what? But just think, without it, we're knackered. Because nothing will live. It'll all die off and we've had it. So thank the gods and the goddesses for rain. Because we've needed it. The last few weeks we've had that hot, dry spell and we've needed it. Not only is it a sustenance, a life giver, it's also a spiritual thing I find, rain, because water has always been classed as a spiritual thing. It's a, a mover of energies. Lots of people use, use water for divination um, as an energy thing. And I find that being out in the rain, although we do get wet, I do find it very cleansing. You know, and, and if you particularly had a bad week or a bad day or whatever and it's and it's raining, I always think, well I like to go out in the garden and just stand in it for five minutes and allow it to wash and cleanse the bad energies from our systems from a bad day or a bad week. It's such a beautiful sound, is that? 
can hear it falling through the canopy. And do you know what the next best thing is to rain? Wind. You get a good a good night when it's blowing a hoodie and you've got rain. It, there's no better thing than falling, you know, lying in bed, listening to it. It puts you to sleep. It puts me to sleep. It's calming. I find it calming. Thunderstorms are amazing as well. What wonderful weather we have. Ooh, we're getting, it's coming down a bit, peeps. Miss Lou's just sat here, Lou. Yeah, I know you're listening, Lou. Hello, baby. Are you wet, Poppet? Hey. Shall we make our way home? Come on. We'll come up the big lane up here. So, yes. As much as people moan about rain, oh, get me out wet. Don't. Without it, we're buggered. Without it, we, you know, the planet will not survive without rain. You say good morning to the fairies, Lou. Hey. Yeah. Yes, it's a little bit of an inconvenience. But so what? You'll soon get dry. Yeah, rain is, is, it's a life giver, it's calming, it's, it's an energy giver, it moves energies, it cleanses, it cleanses your soul, it cleanses your outer body. Rain is so very, very important. And water is so very, very important. So, I've been dripped on. As we walk through the woods, Let's just take time to listen. To a little bit of summer rain. Trying to brighten up, lovelies. It's trying to brighten up. Maybe we'll get a break in the clouds for our walk home. So lovelies. Thank you for coming on a very wet woodland walk with us. I hope you all have a blessed Friday. Enjoy the rain. I know I do. And from a very, very Soggy Miss Lou. Miss Lou, look at Mama, who's going to have to go home and be towel dried. That'll be fun. 
Take care of yourselves, my lovelies. Be kind to one another. And as always, sending you much love and many blessings. <laughs>